And my dear loyal specs, welcome back! My name is Arcane Static. Today we are playing the sequel to Trick and Treat, The Witch's Tea Party. Looks like it's probably gonna be pretty good. That was weird. Let's try this again. There we go. Caution! This is a story-driven adventure game. Please make sure you're fine with the con- We're gonna- there's probably, yeah, auto message. I think we're gonna turn that off so that I can actually read them out loud. There we go. All right, let's do this. Lee Rowe! The world is an amusing place. It's amusing because it's full of troubles, contradictions, and silliness. Don't you agree? But everything has changed. The world's been taken over by humans now. To be honest, they're not as boring or harmless as in the old stories. They're interesting creatures. But my story is not about them. My story is about how terrifying my eyes are. Because, you know, I'm a witch. We established this in the last game. What was I doing in a train station? Ah, uh, it's a long story. It was all Grandma's idea. We were almost late for the tea party. Of course. A party for witches, of course. Andrea, look at you. Pretty good looking little. So wow. Loop, we teleported. Marilyn, that's my grandmother. It's three o'clock. We just made it. And then we both just plap. Relax. It's not good being so stubborn. Besides, it's not like we arrived last. There's still an empty chair. Let's see who hasn't arrived. It's mmm. I'm gonna- There are like eight people! How am I gonna remember all these stupid voices? <clears throat> it's a new guest. I hope she can make it. More new guests? I thought one kid was in the- I'm not gonna remember any of these. <laughs> I'm not a kid. Indeed not. You're more like a baby to me. How old are you? Sixteen? I'm 17. <laughs> anger, anger, anger. We're going to kill you. Manners, little girl. Don't try to join a conversation between the grown-ups when you're less than a hundred years old. Old lady. Please don't, Evangeline. Right now you're not acting like a grown-up yourself. Charlotte is different from you. She's born in a new age, and... And there's the teleport! Oh, look at you! Got like a little cool transparent shawl thing going on. Sorry, I get. Mm. So. Sorry, I guess I'm late. Oh, Xaviera, finally! Welcome, I thought you might miss it! <laughs> I wouldn't miss your party, and it's so nice to meet all the witches in this world. Why is she vaguely Middle Eastern, but I've given her a terrible Cockney accent? Don't ask me! Is this everyone? Yes. Hmm. I didn't know witches were nearing extinction. I didn't know either. Well, apologies once again, ladies. Have some cookies. I especially made them for the party. I hope they'll be nice with tea. Ah, uh, I forgot to introduce myself. My name is... Why are you here? My name is Xaviera. Wait a second. You're the witch from the other day. Oh, so you know Evangeline already. That's great, because I was... And then they both start slinging fireballs at each other. You were the hag that attacked me. It was because you tried to burn our village. Worried about Evangeline's short temper. Great Andrea knows everything. Stop smirking, Mari. It's not funny. I'm not gonna get- Okay, we're dropping the voice charade, because there's no way that I can- Burn the village? Why? How? How should I know? Anyway, we're all Andrea's guests. Let's have some cookies first. <laughs> teleport, teleport, teleport! Ah, the cookies have such weird colors, and they smell like foreign spices. It's unexpectedly- Ooh, Mirabelle, you're cute. 
Why are you holding a bouquet of flowers and wearing what looks to be a wedding dress? Renee likes it. Renee speaks in third person. Renee is definitely not so Seiseki, we promise. And then there's Stephanie, the dark one. Really? What? Hork! Blah! What is this? What's wrong with you making cookies spicy hot? Yeah, I see what you did there. It's not just hot, you see. There were all kinds of herbs and a lot of butter to balance the taste. It's my first time- Oh my god! She's card captor Sakura! With freckles and glasses. Yep. Alright. I'm in. I didn't know you couldn't take spicy food at all. There is also seafood flavor. Would you like some? <laughs> Alright, so the weird-ass one is like, yes, give me them fish cookies. I'm in for fish cookies. Seafood cookies. Are you sure? Thank you, Xaviera. And then Evangeline is just a bitch. That's enough! What are you doing? Bribed by some crazy cookies from a weirdo that you've never met? This witch is a lackey of humans! You don't know anything! She shouldn't be here at all! This is insane! You... Why don't you give it a break? I tried to make the party enjoyable, but you... You're hopeless. Andrea, I see your problem. It is a shame that there are witches like you. No wonder you're extinct. Ooh, we start in a fight. What did you say? Saviera, please don't fight. Whoa, whoa, why not? Fight, fight! <laughs> this is great already. How dare you? Ooh, there's the fireballs. Yep, they're starting to fight. How could a tea party become like this? Fight! Yeah! Woohoo! Renee? Evangeline, Xaviera, please stop! I didn't want this stupid party from the beginning! It was just because you kept nagging. Humph! <laughs> so screw off then! I'm sorry, it doesn't seem like I fit here either. Excuse me, Andrea. So they've got two different teleportation methods, that's fine. Now this is a mess. Don't worry, Dre, I'll help you out. Go invite Xaviera again. I know you've been looking forward to this party for years. Now everyone's gone. Ah, Grandma! Sorry, ladies, please wait for me. Even the hostess left? I guess the party is completely ruined, says Vanessa. Why don't you pull out some of your cards and make some magic happen, Sakura? A messy party is a good party. Renee is so happy. Loud Evangeline is gone. Stubborn Andrea has left. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Look at that face. Let's have our happy, cheerful, delicious tea, all right? Jesus. This is for Andrea's tea party. <laughs> oh, jeez. This is... This is getting good. It's raining. I have to go back to the house. My room was added to the quests. We have quests now. Use arrow keys to control your character. Hold shift to run. Z or space is talk and investigate. Q is open menu. Escape is close the menu. F4 is blah, blah, blah. Okay. But I came here directly in the garden. I don't know where the house is. Hmm. Hmm. What can I interact with? A giant teacup as the garden decoration. You are a save point, no longer the floating book thing anymore. Alright. Neat, so this doesn't look like it's RM2K5 anymore. A giant teapot as the garden decoration. More teapots, or er, teacups? Yeah, looks like there's just gonna be that, but just in case. You never know where people hide junk in RPG Maker games. Hmm. 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 What's going on over here? Nothing, 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 tra-la-la. -la. Hmm. Keep on moving. Hey, it's a magic witch house. Wow, a witch's house. It's a bit terrifying. Heart. Disappointment, chaos, horror, hostility. <laughs> These are the best. 
There she is. These are the perfect decorations for Andrea's party. <laughs> are you lost? Are you scared? Let's have some fun, all right? Renee has been identified as an antagonist. Not all right at all. This is too weird. How can I get out? Renee's information was updated. Charlotte will get to know every witch in the game's progress. The collected information can be viewed later in Charlotte's room. Uh, what have, what have I got in here? Neat! It's so cute! See what I got for items. Nothing. Okay. What about for thinking? Where am I? Okay, I see. Quests. Available. My room. It's raining. I'd better go back to my room. Steps. Find my room. Okay. What else? System. System is just this stuff. Okay. You are a book. Where are you going? Shall we play? Shall we play? Hmm. Surely there's like invisible pathways or something somewhere. Oh look! There's Cardcaptor Sakura. Over here is some kind of moving bear. Looks like it's gonna be antagonist Chan's. Here we go. Got a toy keyblade. Oh no. It's made of wood. Okay, so it's not the Kingdom Hearts BS style actual keyblade business. Alright, alright, well, how are we going here? Hey look, it's you. There's someone here. Harga Burga. Ah! Oh, you're Charlotte. Yes, and it's my first time attending the tea party. It's great to know I'm not the only one trapped here. I'm not trapped, but it's surely something. I've never been to a house like this. Andrea's house isn't usually like this. It's just Renee's trick. Hmm, Renee. It's all dark. When will she let us out? Why are you afraid? Don't be such a coward. You're a witch, too. Sorry, I am. I mean, a coward. Don't admit it! Sorry, I'm lectured by a kid. Shall we find the exit together, then? You know, I've never been to Andrea's house. Ah, uh, sure, it's nice to have company. Party members! This one may just be a pushover. Sweet! Alright, what have I got? Talk! Renee is dangerous. We'd better return to our rooms. Okay! Look out window. It's completely dark. When are you escaping? It's hilarious to see you fleeing. I'm not fleeing. Hmm. Save point! Whamma bamma save! And there we go. Alright, so I came through this door. It might take me back where I was coming from. Yes, it does. Okay, so there's none of this Silent Hill business going on. Over here, there is another save point. When are you escaping? It's hilarious to see- oh, okay, so this is what's happening here. I go through here, it takes me through the same door. Yeah, if I go through here, it takes me back down. So over this one. Hey! Teddy bear. Got a toy key bow. What have you got to say, you dumb bear? Charlotte, you're brave. Maybe. I won't be scared by some teddy bears. Let's just get out of here. Alright. Nothing? Nothing, I guess. Alright. Nothing in here, nothing in here. What about my items? Hmm. If I can put it together... Hey! We got me a toy key. There we go. Down here takes us to one of these. Nothing is written here is written on the book. This takes us back to bear. Okay, so then let's go back and... Uh, dang it! Let's go back and explore all of the possible... Out of the... There we go. Hey, look! Are you alright? Buh! Hmm! And then she just left. Hey, what was that? I was trying to help you. Mirabelle's information is updated. Maybe she went this way? Okay. Up through here. Hallway. Check. Up through here. Same room. Down through here. Dead end. Down through here takes me up to there, so this is the one that we need to go through. Bamo. The music's pretty cool. Digging it so far. 
Alright, what do we got? It's locked. Well, why don't we use the key? It worked! Oh, the key broke. Oh look, they brought that art style back. That's neat. What? Enemies? Enemies? Do we fight? Are you lost in this dark mist? Where are you going, our new guest? I don't know, get out of my way. You don't know where your room is, but I do. <laughs> that is a disturbing teddy bear. Of course I can tell you if you want to know. The host is high above all, living with honored guests. We all know Andrea and Marilyn are neighbors and best friends. There is no guest room on the ground floor. And in the attic, there is only dust. Is this a logic puzzle? Okay, so let's see. The hostess, high above all, living with honored guests. The hostess is Andrea, yes. We all know Andrea and Marilyn are neighbors and best friends. I remember my room is not on the same floor as Grandma's. How do you know that? There is no guest room on the ground floor. Not the ground floor. In the attic, there is only dust. I guess nobody lives there. Which floor is your room on? Oh, I didn't see the thing. Which floor is your room on? It's not the attic. It's not the ground floor. It's not the second floor, so that must be the first floor. There we go. What will happen next? Me. <laughs> the door is unlocked. All right, well, that wasn't so hard. Though the atmosphere isn't quite right, I think we're back in the house. Fine, I shall find my room first. Punk this bear out of the way. What about you, punk bear? How about you, weird piano? Everything is in negative. I don't think I can play piano very well. The plant is a very weird color. Nothing is going on in here. Yeah, it's just everything is in, in negative colors. The bears don't do anything. None of this stuff does anything. Okay, let's just move on then, shall we? It's so dark here, too. At least we know your room is also on the first floor, same as mine. Okay, let's go upstairs then. This is British, because in America, the first floor is the ground floor. A small cabinet that looks fairly normal. Fairly normal. Weird color plants, weird color plants. It won't open. Ah, the familiar ka-chunk, ka-chunk sound. What about you? You will open, but that takes us up. I would like to explore more first. Hmm. What if we go this way? It won't open. I didn't even know there was a door there. Alright, so chances are we have to go up. Little parlor room. Andrea's cloak is hanging on the coat rack. And looks like we can't- I can't get out. Andrea locked us up. Are we sure it was Andrea and not Renee? This is where we came from, that weird parlor room. There wasn't a door there before, was there? Ah, okay. Well, those teddy bears are gone as well. Alright, well, let's go upstairs in the next episode! Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for watching. I hope that you've enjoyed it so far. It looks like it's a pretty decent game so far. We'll see how it goes. Uh, if you liked it, the like and subscribe buttons are waiting just below the video. Please click them. I like it when you do. You can also follow my socials. That's the Facebook and Twitter that are down in the description box. To do that, too, maybe I'll post more things. I'm working on the Patreon thing again, but it's not going to be up for a while because I don't feel like I'm putting out anything worthwhile for that thing yet. But look for it in the future, maybe. I will see you next time. Happy Halloween.